My name's Liv and I'm a dance coach here, casual dance coach at Tranmere Rovers and my role involves uh, going into primary schools, working with them, teaching them dance and um, I also help out with uh, the women's fit fans where I can and I watch Frankie do that, she leads that session and I like to be involved with the dementia sessions that we do and the disability sessions that we offer and it's really just about uh, encouraging dance in the community. Brilliant, yeah. So. Um... Obviously you've touched on it there, but which of our sessions do you, do you help out with at the moment? So at the moment I do uh, primary schools, I'm in two primary schools. Um, I do help with the adult disability that we offer as well, which is we get have fun and do some chair dance. I also get some dementia session and um, both the fit fan sessions that we offer here. I managed to pop my head into them and just see what's going on with the physical side of things because they're really interesting sessions to watch. So yeah, but what I love about this job is being able to jump in with anything that's going on. I've also joined in with things like boogie bounce, which is something I never thought I would have said that I'd done, but um, yeah, and I've played football, I've played walking netball, I've managed to do a lot of things since working here in the short time that I have been here, and that's one of my favourite things about it, is that every day is so different. Yeah, that's brilliant, that. So obviously here at Tramie, we pride ourselves on our provision for four women with influential figures, yeah, such as Louise, who we've spoken to already for International Women's Day. What's it like working in an environment with lots of strong women and in influential positions like that? Yeah, it's um, definitely really important for me as a young woman to see where this job has grown and taken people because I know that Louise has been here for like a long time. She's going to kill me for saying that, but <laughs> you know, she's been here since forever and she's known, learned so much on the road and it's great to have her to help me as she has. But for me personally, someone that's really important to me, my role here would be Frankie, who's um, the head of dance. Here. She's been like a really good role model for me and I think when she came into this job there was no one else doing dance so she had to kind of do it all on her own and I've been lucky that I've had her to rely on with any questions and it's just really nice to see uh, her in that position and where she's taken it and be inspired by another woman doing something that I would like to attain to do and in the office as well. It's a lot of fun because the girls, there's loads of girls and we have a laugh so yeah it's really good seeing a lot of women in a lot of important roles like I know Shirley who runs a dementia session uh, it's really inspiring to see her and how she does things in her own way and everybody does it differently but we all come together as well and help each other out uh, and we have a proper laugh so yeah it's great but especially Frankie for me she's an important figure for me personally. Yeah it's good to hear about your role models even within our team obviously. Yeah. So how much do you feel that um, we, we, we currently do here at Samia for, for women's sport with regards to participants? Yeah it's really important for me and to work somewhere that recognises uh, women and international women say the way this club does. I think um, it's a really good place to work, you know, that um, international women say is recognised in maybe a way that it hasn't been before, but Tramir's really represents that well. And um, we offer sessions catered for women. We have women's walk in football, um, which is like really always seems like a good life that Louise runs, as you know. And um, we have a Zumba session led by Frankie, uh, which has sort of come off the back of the Women's Fit Fans session, so that's something that we offer as well, and um, that's all about women's fitness, and that's a really nice place as well, really comfortable, we all have a laugh and a chat, and then Zumba is something that's come off that, all the ladies that attend Fit Fans who are now interested in doing that with Frankie, and they get really good numbers for it, and it's, it's really fun, and it's nice to see so much women in a safe environment where they can feel like they can come and be open and have fun and really just enjoy it, what we have to offer for them. That's great, yeah. So how do you feel we can continue to progress and provide an opportunity for women? I think just carry on the way that we're going. Like, I'm, I'm really happy that even this interview is like a sign of how far things are going, like the social media side of things, picking up on days like International Women's Day that recognises hardships that women have been through um, and things like that and the importance of everything, that equal opportunities and I think Tranmere definitely offers that, especially us in the community. Everything's very equal, you know, with the recent things like that you've been doing for International Women's Day and you know, all the book collection. I think it's really important and I think we're going in a direction that seems very positive for women, so yeah. Perfect, thanks very much for that. Thank you, Tom. <laughs>